Welcome, welcome, welcome to TNT, aka TNT Entertainment. Welcome. Welcome. And uh, we're about to do a reaction with Zip with the drip. But yeah, we just I, gonna get right to the point, okay? That's right, that's right. Boom. Shit you can't even pronounce like that. You know what I'm saying? It's mentioned in the Quran one time. It's mentioned in the Quran one time. He just, oh, my name is in the Quran. My name is in the Quran. One time. Yeah. So. I want to let you listen to this nigga. Mind you, he talked bad about my father for being in jail. My father went to jail, they said, for killing the police. His little brother's his co-defendant. He threw, they say he threw a grenade at the police. That's why my father was in jail. That's why my father and them niggas is in jail. I went to jail knocking niggas down before. This nigga questions the type of man that I am. This, this. I'm going to let you listen to something. Uh-oh. I'm going to let you listen to a nigga. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Because my mom had me at 15. Yeah, anyways, everybody knows this dude right here on the screen as Cat Williams. So I already know with the look on Zip's face, he's about to roast this guy. Yeah, my dad was all off into his 20s at the time. So that's basically my story, minus the, the, the prostitution and the, uh, oh. my dad and mom being cousins. But that whole story is basically mine. So I was mature for my age. And I was let me tell you something. My mother always told me this. Never let nobody know your past, your business, and your plans. I don't care who it is. If it's your mother, your father, your grandparents, your friends, your coworkers, your boss, you don't tell nobody nothing. Not even your kids. Keep your thoughts to yourself. Nobody needs to know about your life. This is how people use things against you. You feel me? I was born that year. My dad was all off into his 20s at the time. So that's basically my story. Minus the, the, the prostitution and the, uh, my dad and mom being cousins. But that whole story is basically mine. So I was mature for my age. Did you ever mention my father? And your, your father's a rainbow. Ain't it sound like you saying your Ain't it sound like you saying your mother and your father was cousins? No. I'm not that you know, you know, you uppity Negroes, you niggas got a way of talking when you 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 might not have said that. But god damn it. Cuz my mom had me at 15 and I was born that year. My dad was well off into his twenties. At the time, so that's basically my story. Minus the, the, the prostitution and the uh, my dad and mom being cousins, but my dad and my mom being cousins. Are you saying your dad and your mom is cousins? That's why he looked like that. That's why he looked like Cat Williams. This is exactly why he. I'm sorry. No disrespect. No pun intended. Respectfully, this ain't it, bro. This ain't it. By the look on Zip face, you can tell it's not it. Because then that would make you an incest baby. Hmm. It, it, that's, that, that's what it just sounds like you said. That your mom and your dad is cousins. And that your dad was well off into his 20s when your mother was 15. So not only is you an incest baby, but your father's a scraper. Yeah. Yeah, so even if you ain't, even if that ain't what you said, you still said your father's a scraper, and you had the nerve to talk bad about my parents, say anything crazy about my parents, huh? Huh, nigga? 
You niggas is easy. Let you niggas talk long enough, y'all niggas will tell on yourself. I dare corny ass, square ass nigga like you say something bad about my father when that nigga down for allegedly knocking down the fucking police. And you, and you, your father's a scrapo, nigga. Your father is a scrapo, nigga. And you call him your dad. And you call him your dad. Cousin and dad. Hey. Yeah. If we inherit things from our father, that I would hate to. I would hate to be you. Me too. Perhaps my father shouldn't be in jail for 43 years. Maybe your father should have went to jail for that long. Nasty ass nigga. Nigga's a nasty bastard. Maybe he should have. Maybe they should have cash traded him. Maybe they should have did that. Or was it your mother that seduced him with her little fast ass? Huh? That's what your father says. Your father. Yo, she seduced me, man. Yo, man, she seduced me, man. <laughs> it's your father's fault, nigga. He's a scrapo, nigga. Yeah, it's his fault. He's a scrapo. He's the one that should have knew better in the situation. Your mother was a little girl. No, he's making scenarios, but it's like you don't know what happened. You wasn't there, is it? You wasn't there. Who is you to speak on somebody's situation? I get where you're coming from, but come on, bro, move on. It ain't different when you well off in your twenties and you put a baby in a chick that ain't even sixteen. Now there you have it, y'all. We'll be back with another video very soon. And tune in. Like, like, comment, share, subscribe if you're new. And we out, bruh.